Hello and welcome to our new exciting series of our super function called xlookup. This function is basically available in 365 insiders and uh, thousands of my students around the world are asking me how to integrate this xlookup into their 2013 and 16 so that they can also use an xlookup. Uh, as you know that there are many videos available on YouTube about um, about xlookup and they tell you how it works but nobody is telling you how to integrate it into your system so that you can also do that today i will be showing i will be showing you step by step details of how to integrate this into your system so that you can also use it into your excel in my next video i will show you the basics of uh, xlookup how you can use it into your different procedures and you can replace VLOOKUP and MATCH and INDEX. This function uh, is basically a replica of 365 INSIDER and uh, it has a capacity or capability of doing almost 80% of the functions of uh, XLOOKUP which is actually available in 365 INSIDER. So let's start the procedures. As you can see there is a link available over here and for your convenience what I have done is that I have put it into my um, in, below into the description so that you can copy the link from there so copy this link go into your browser and download from the folder the two files which is one is 32 bit and 64 bit and for your convenience I've already downloaded it into my system. There's a 32 bit and 64 bit Okay, and now let me go on to my Excel first So right now if I write is equals to X you can see there is IRR NVP and X or functions are available, but X lookup is not available. So what I will do. What is the step? I will go into file I will go into options then I will go into add-ins from here I will go into go I will say browse go into the folder where the files are downloaded okay uh, in my case there's a desktop and it's over here and over here and in my case I need a 64 bit so I will use 64 and you will use whatever your system requirement is. I will say OK. And now as you can see that Excel DNA is uploaded here and there's a tick mark over here. So I will do nothing. I will simply press OK. And now if I go into my system and say X and here you can see the X lookup is available on my system and if I say control A sorry is equals to X lookup bracket start control A and now you can see this fully functional argument box and you can do whatever you want to do here in my next video I will show you how you can use XLOOKUP to pick data from right side as well as from the left side of the column. I uh, will also show you how you how this XLOOKUP can replace match and index. If you need any clarification, please do let us know by your comments at the at the below, and we'll get back to you. And uh, please pr press thumbs up if you have liked this video. And subscribe my channel so that you can stay tuned on the new developments on this on, on this topic. Thanks for tuning in. Bye.